I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to find the inverse of a radical function. Now, finding the inverse of a radi radical function is just like finding the inverse of any function. As long as you uh, follow the steps of finding the inverse function, you could find it however you like, radical function or not. So let's give an example of a radical function, and we'll practice finding the inverse using those same consistent steps. So for example, let's just say you want to find the inverse of the function. Let's just say the cube root of x minus 1. So the first step involves you letting y equals to f of x. So you have y is equal to the cube root of x minus 1. Now the second step is very critical because it allows you to find the inverse formally. You want to switch the places between x and y. So every y you put an x, and for every x you put y. Okay, so you have now have x equals cube root of y minus 1. It's arguably the most pivotal step in the process. Because where you want to go after this is you want to solve for y. So to get y by itself, you want to get rid of the radical. So that means you want to cube both sides. So x cubed is equal to... What happens here is that the cube root and the cubes cancel, so you have x minus 1 left over. And then to solve for y completely, you add the 1 to both sides. You have x cubed plus 1 is equal to y. And so now y is by itself. You want to replace the y with the inverse function notation. So in other words, you're going to have f inverse of x is equal to x cubed plus 1. What that means here is the inverse of the cube root of x minus 1 is x cubed plus 1. Not too surprising given the fact that if the original function is, has a cube root, the inverse function has a cube, and if the original function has subtraction 1, the inverse has a plus 1. So as long as you follow the steps to finding an inverse of a function period, you'll be able to find the inverse of a radical function. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's a demonstration on finding the inverse of a radical function.